Welcome back everyone to Let's Play Distant Worlds 2, episode number 31, I think. Uh, anyways, it's been four days in the last one. I, I find this just as an amusing anecdote. Um, I think it's just interesting how the psychology of humans work. I think that uh, probably I would be receiving praise for the frequency of my episodes if they were um, every two days at 25 minutes each. But people will be kind of like uh, reluctant to wait four days for 50 minutes each and I think I would do the same thing I'm I'm like also one of these people <laughs> but it got kind of the same amount of if I just cut this episode in half which would also be more intro and outro fluff um, that'd be less total quality video recording time then people would probably be happy anyway well let's get to this one I think we have some at least initially I can start off with a few fun things oh well fun for me fun for you I don't know if they overlap what's the Venn diagram for that one but first of all I want to go over to our small spaceport and I have decided that yes this is worth upgrading so I will upgrade it because um some places we're probably only gonna want to keep a small spaceport and in the others like the upkeep medium spaceport is a thousand for this one whereas for the smaller one it's about half so it's a pretty substantial difference I'm gonna copy this one as new it correctly got the name which is great uh, we're just gonna remove the three fission put in the latest fusion reactors I don't know if we need two or three we'll probably only need two but let's let's see if we can get away with two um, then what else can we upgrade? This is all fine. Does this thing not have, okay, fuel cells. Those can be upgraded. Large fuel cell. Um, crew systems are fine. Energy collectors, 150, 106, it's good. Uh, yeah, I think that's really all we need to do here. And that has apparently saved us 30 space already. Concussion missiles, star beams, we probably can't do much more than what we are already doing with these. And they are getting upgraded as as we go. To enhanced armor, so we can definitely add more armor or shields with the extra space. Crystal sensors. So this crystal sensors probably should change to a large tracking one. So let me get this track target tracking. So target tracking should go into this one. And the long range sensor array is gonna go here. Damn, I knew it. Okay, so that's still something that we may want to try to do. You know what? No, I think we're just going to go with the crystal sensor, which means I need to go to all components for a moment. Yeah, and what we'll do instead is switch over from a small fighter bay to a medium fighter bay. I think that's an excellent use of the space that we've saved for ourselves. We're looking good with the reactor. I think this is just a, a solid kind of potentially final design for the small spaceports. Everything looks good here. I just want to make sure that this is the most up to date. Do we have any like, so medical center V2, medical center V2, just want to make sure commerce is V2, yep. Recreation center, it's good. I feel like there's something I'm missing. Cargo bays? Is it cargo bays? What improved that I'm missing? Maybe nothing. Maybe this is it. Star beams are automatically upgraded. So are the concussion missiles. Well, with eight size, we don't have much else we can do anyway. Um, it's not enough for the armor, unfortunately. I think this is sufficient, though. We'll save and exit, especially because we don't really want to spend the whole episode doing you know, ship design again. Deactivate or obsolete the uh, Mark 2-6. And the last one that we want to look at here is the medium troop ship. This should be upgraded to the troop ship 4. Let's see what it would need, if anything. Because technically this one is outdated, but maybe not. Fusion reactors. When was this one done? Maybe I... Oh yeah, it has been updated already. Well, hooray! That means we're actually done with everything here. Ooh, except for the monitoring station. What's going on here? 27, we had one. Oh, this is, I, I get it. This is like a, a design that we acquired. So, and the retrofit is on 
manual, and actually the monitoring station itself is on automatic. Fair enough. And when I actually decide to get a monitoring station, that's when I'll probably decide to design it. But let's do this thing that we haven't done for practically two full episodes, which is unpause the game. Oh. Yeah, I don't really care. So off we go into the great blue yonder. Um, what is our plan here? Besides just advancing time and getting more research. I would like for it to involve something about getting more colonies, but I've mentioned that before. I think it is going to be hard to undermine our alliance here. We could start doing it though. I mean, it'll kind of make us hated within the galaxy. We have so many. We have. We, it's just going to take us so long to for them, <laughs> for them to dislike us. Okay, close that. Okay, our reputation is down to only negative 13, which is, is good to know. Why are you unpaused? Why are you not unpaused, I should say? Um, ancient ruins for 7,000 is actually pretty cheap. Can we climb that? Whoa, 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 whoa. Things are happening. We'll go down to 2x. Okay. Um, 7,000. I'm not sure. Let's look at this. Efficient point defense research is complete. Buckling, buckler repeating blaster PD. This must have been spies doing. Dismiss. Yeah, we're getting some, some lag here, unfortunately. Yeah, so Maki did it. That was from the Gakirian territory as well. Interesting. So I know that we sent most of our people to the consciousness, the Scar and consciousness. But let's take one more look at the Gakirians. Gakirians. See if there's any other research we might want to take from them. What in the world is going on right now? This game seems to be lagging more than usual. Oh man, multi-role starships. Absolutely. This is really good. 90% is pretty bad though, so let's go see if the Baskaran Sovereign or Consciousness has it. Oh, it's 87 from them. Well, yeah, let's try to... Oh, it was 87 for something else. Durr. Oh. Ultra Dunce Prince... No, oh, that's bad. Let's go to the Consciousness. And what was it? I don't even remember what it was called. Uh, Multi-roll. Multi-roll. They just appear to have everything. 71. Huh. Okay, well, I'll take it at 70, I mean at 90, because apparently that's the best I can do. We also have uh, one of those things which I don't care about. On Taran Empire, I've suffered a deadly outbreak of uh, Tortuga power destroying their home planet. Uh, also, Dakara virus strikes Pulmonar 4. Uh, it takes nine months to recover from. Well, I would say good luck to them, but I really don't like them, so I'm, I'm just going to ignore that altogether, I guess. Yeah, Kyrians want a research agreement. Funny, I just offer, I just told my spy to go steal their stuff, and now we can talk about research agreements. I wonder if I should accept this. Maybe I can... I would really like to just do it myself. Let me reject this deal. Get some real lag. I don't know why that's happening. Probably should just move to the beta branch or something. Anyway, I would like to speak with you. Yeah, so what I'd like is a research agreement. And military refueling. And... Exploration and territory. And, you know, territory and map sharing, sure. You will accept. Okay, goodbye. Goodbye. Click, click, click. Okay. Um, I'm, I'm just going to decline. Because this lag is bothering me. Yeah, well, we don't need to accept that. We already did it. 
Academy. Okay, fair enough. So let me escape out. Man, I wonder... Okay, so just make sure I turn off this stuff every now and then, and that'll help. Okay, moving on. I hope they auto-pause whatever is important is happening, because I'm, I'm just going to take my hands off the keyboard and take a drink. Delicious. Money's going up pretty quickly, that's good to see. I do want to take our friends, man. <laughs> the Xenox planets are just too tempting. Yeah, you know what? <clears throat> there has been something that I've been neglecting. So people have been leaving very good comments still. I want to make sure that I acknowledge those. And one of them was about not building these stations. I, I think I actually addressed this last time, but I've decided that, you know what? You're right. Uh, oh yeah, another comment was that somebody said, I, I'm not making any ground up with a limited terraforming facility. So I can either destruct this and save 7,500 um, a year, or <clears throat> Um, the alternative, and the reason why I keep it is because I always have this in mind that I'm going to do it quickly. I just don't end up doing it quickly, so it ends up not paying off. The next tier terraforming um, facility, you can actually upgrade to it. So it costs 150000 if you build it from scratch, but I think it's only 75000 if I'm not mistaken. I'm not sure, um, but it, it's a reduced cost if you're just upgrading the previous terraforming facility. So I mean, the math is pretty simple, right? You can just take the amount that it would cost you to upgrade versus how much it costs to do maintenance, and you can divide the number of years it'll take you before you have enough research or money to get the upgraded one. And hey, there you go. If you know, X number of years times the maintenance you're paying on the original is more than the difference in the price if you upgrade versus building from scratch. Well, one of those options is going to be better. I suspect that um, with the maintenance of 7,500, and let's just pretend that it is 10 years out. Are we 10 years out from getting that research? I don't think so. So you know what? I am going to, thanks to that person, I am going to cancel this. There it goes. Um, okay, so then we can probably go to the, well, we don't have the money yet, but eventually we'll go over to the other places and get their, their them upgraded. The, another one of the downsides though is that you don't get any um, bonus to quality improvement if you have any, net, like any of those events which change the quality of the planet temporarily. You recover faster, obviously your terraforming planet, um, terraforming facility helps you recover a lot faster. Oh well, I, I think this is still the right move. We don't, have, we don't have enough money for any of the other facilities, so I don't know why I was getting all excited and zooming into the planet. That was a false alarm. Yeah, we can kind of just sit and, what the heck? The board and kind of all people are showing back up? That's funny. Well yeah, go ahead and blast the crap out of this guy. <laughs> Looks like he's running away. Well, it kind of makes sense now that you see that there's a whole fleet after him. Yeah, we should get those things basically as soon as we can. Oh, this guy's jumping. He doesn't want any part of this. I don't blame him. Almost done with officer training. Kind of makes me think, what do we have next? Capacitor overloading? Okay, that is fine. And we won't have enough money to crash research that one because it'll take 230,000 apparently. But actually, since we didn't really spend that much time in the research screen earlier, that will beg the question, what exactly do we want to do next? Spend 30 years getting advanced research? That's always an option. <laughs> it will improve the efficiency of our research. Yeah, we've actually stolen a fair amount of technology as far as 
I have mean, obviously I haven't researched a single one of these. So we have yeah, you know, plenty of them considering. Okay, officer training is just about to finish. Could do So we want that military academy. How much is it? 50,000, dang. I really can't do that and crash research the next one at the same time. Well, I mean, not immediately. It's gonna be a, a priority list. Hmm. So I never got the better recreation center, which is kind of funny. <laughs> oh well, oh my gosh, I just realized, did I ever send my spy? Okay, I did. For some reason I, I panicked, I thought that the Mac had never been assigned, but no, I'm, I'm mistaken. This is 35 days, we're up in the weapons now, it's weird. The only one I would consider getting is swarm missiles route, getting the lightning missiles, and then high capacity batteries I guess. It's not really interesting, I don't want that first. Uh, maybe it is time to start getting troop stuff again. Infantry attack strength up, infantry defense strength up, and then do a, another round of recruitment and all that. It could be done. I don't think it's a high priority. This is kind of nice, actually, this enhanced battlefield medicine. is just a pure like passive bonus to troop recovery rate. Doesn't require a facility. And this one's also nice, the troop maintenance savings. And our honestly, our troop maintenance is pretty high. I think I'm gonna actually go for this one. It's gonna be a while, so I may just look for it as one of the things I wanna steal with the spies. But I'm gonna keep an eye out for advanced logistics. After that, we can maybe do quantum exploitation so we can get the uh, end game. No, this is the second most. Yeah, zero point reactor is the last one but one of the best uh, reactors. And we haven't really done anything as far as hyperdrives go, and those are always, well, good to stay on top of. Increased maneuverability. I keep talking about these hybrid thrusters, how this would be a good thing for me to do, but I never do it. But once again, we should do it. <laughs> just say that again. Fighters, I just really haven't invested much in fighters. I'd rather do that for our, either the Darians or the humans. Um, where is the multi-role starships? This is going to give us light cruisers. That's pretty cool. Hmm. Advanced shipyard. I don't think we need it. Huh. This would be a hundred. That might help in some situations, but they'll be pretty few and far between. Fleet targeting is an option. Yeah, you know what? I, I, I just, we haven't settled on other planets, but let me see if there's another planet out there that would be a good one. Besides all this other stuff. Oh yeah, it's gonna be really far away though. Oh yeah, that one's in there. Okay, that's fine. Oh, 43. Where? Wow, way over there. Okay, that one's not too far. 13, I'm not gonna do. It's pretty close though. 30, 36, 35. Yeah, they're not giving me anything. Oh, wait, oh, that was 19, that's not good. Um, they're not giving me anything but ice planets. Wait. <laughs> nice tundra. Dang it. Yeah. Okay, all right, well, we're just not gonna have this. It's not gonna happen as far as ice plants go. That's the message I'm receiving loud and clear.
We don't even really need to unpause, I mean pause when the next research finishes because it's going to go to the next one and we can't crash research that one anyway. Oh, now we can. I mean, do something. So we actually got efficient hyperdrives, which is great. Good job to Yak, who stole it, no doubt, from hidden hijackers. Oh no, Baskaran consciousness. That's what I thought. Baskaran consciousness. So what was the one I was trying to tell myself to do? It was an advanced whatever one though. I can't remember what it is. Advanced. Should be somewhere around here, no? Yeah, it was like right... Advanced Logistics, there it is. It was right in front of my face. Yeah, it's here. 91, great. Um, okay, we got the ion point defense, that's great. Cody? Oh. I reversed him, but that's fine. What is another one I need? I guess I could see if there's anything left on what's the other one that we he just came from, or the other one came from. I, gosh, I don't remember. Hidden Skyjackers, right? Oh wow, they don't have anything left. I mean, they have tons of languages, but those are not the important. They're not the priority. <coughs> Excuse me. Man, there's so much to do here. I guess advanced hyperdrives? Wow, that's really low. Let's take a look at the hyperdrives. Maybe that's something I'm interested in going towards. Um, fast, high speed. We could do the hyper jump inhibiting. I think somebody already might be doing that though. So let's do either fast or high speed. Yeah, hyperdrive, hyper jump inhibiting. Fast or high speed. fast. It's the one that came up first. Okay, moving on. Let's see if we can get some 2x speed out of this. I'm still not sure whether or not I should build the... Okay, pulmonar. Yeah, we, said, we do have a lot of facilities to build. And yeah, you know what? I think we will build one of the science ones. Oh no! It's been spreading. Hopefully it doesn't come our way. So Hairball, are you... I have this Science Academy here already. Okay, this is going to take 50,000, which we're now past. High tech is a good one. Weapons, armor, troop. Reactor shields, hyperdrive. What are we doing? Shields. So we'll probably want the shields. It's going to take a while to build, but this is going to take two years to research, so I guess it's fine. Go ahead and build it. Oh, well, somebody, some poor independent is getting wrecked by the virus now. living, breathing universe. Yeah, Weapons Academy. Well, hey, we're not that far behind doing the same thing now. Okay, evaded detection, very good. Hyper jump inhibiting, we'll send them right back. Hyper jump. Oh my gosh, we're negative. Well, that's no bueno. Is he dead? Is he dead? Can you guys kill him? Oh man, just focus on... It was too greedy. Just 
Just focus on the one that's, you know, bird in the hand is worth two in the bush. What the heck is going on here? Hey, you know what? Whoa. Oh. Yeah. Kill this guy. <laughs> um, just waiting for it to spread to me, but so far, so good. Okay, got large civilian ships. Large, the scrolling is really deadly. Go get it. Seems like this will last forever. I think he's slowly healing, which is not what you want to see necessarily. Oh my god, it's down there. Don't I have like a single ship down here? The answer is no. I can build one though, right? I think we have a spaceport here somewhere. That's not us. <laughs> nope, we don't want that. I'm pretty sure we have a port here though, right? Wow, we're gonna offer that? No, no way. Show me. Alright, this is one. Okay, two's there, one's here. Great. Go and kill this guy. Automated sentries? What? Well, I think that's the thing I'm trying to destroy. He went away anyway. Huh. A mystery. Oh, they offer us a defense pact, huh? <clears throat> Operations map sharing, research agreement, migration treaty is a no. Strictly forbidden, I'm sorry. This is an explorer ship or what? Yeah, of course. Wow, it's way out there. Apparently stolen. Wow! Multi roll starships. Holy cow! Mac, you came through. Wow! In a big, big, big way. Wow! We have light cruisers. That was that was definitely unexpected. I didn't expect this episode to become another ship design one. I think we're heading that way. No, no, no. Research, research. Like that advanced construction one at the top looked pretty good. Construction specialization. Is that not one of the things that we are already like lean, leaning towards or I thought we actually already did it. Construction specialization. <clears throat> I don't know where that is. So wait, did this actually unlock, what are we missing? 35% construction research bonuses from all sources. We don't have 35? What the heck? We 
We have a plus 35% research speed. It asks us if we have 35% research bonuses, so we obviously do. Is it rounding though? Do we have like 35.9? <laughs> I don't know, maybe. Okay, well, anyway, we'll just research that thing that we need to research anyhow. Could get a better medium spaceport. Um, I don't think that's a high priority. Could do the fleet targeting. I don't really care about stealth, which I've said before. So this is the colonization stuff. I mean, as a Xenox, it's not that important. I mean, we could do this, which is going to get us closer to unlocking enhanced colonization, which I would like. It's just, a, man, it's four years to do it. Okay, so we have better troop and passenger compartments. We can either get better troops or better passengers. Yikes, I don't really think either of those are a critical thing. Could always just try to make more money. Mm, yeah. Yeah, I think I'll do that. I mean, we can also get the biological workshops, but we have plenty of stuff to, to build now. As soon as we have the money to build it. Which, speaking of, we almost have enough. The Energy Academy is already done? Wow. I didn't see a notification about it. Or maybe I did and I didn't read it. Wait, we can afford it. We can afford it. Oh, wait, no, we can't. Okay. It's uh, apparently a fluctuating thing, the economy here. A little bit dynamic. How is my chance of researching going? I mean, of crash researching? Ooh. 150,000. That is a pretty penny. Oh my gosh, our, sport, our spy here is not doing anything. Sorry, Mac. Yeah, that's what I was doing over there, was just trying to get this all worked out. And that did give me some ideas, but of course I forgot about passing those on to the spy. Right, I was looking for the construction, whatever, and I still don't know if I found that. But large-scale construction seems good. I think we already have large civilian ships going. So, defense bases might be interesting. Like I said, large scale construction, advanced destruction. I haven't even built that cruiser yet. Man, we got a lot to do. Okay, let me do this. We're not going to get to the cruiser yet. I almost declined by just pure accident. And then I caught myself. Okay, looking good. Not that that attack on one of my people is good, but... I feel like we're settling in. We definitely have the money now to do something more. Okay, so we have the Energy Academy. We can do... Weapons Armor Troop. I think I need to go research the construction one. Funny enough. Wow, we're still encountering independent colonies. That's that's a lot of independent colonies. Show me so we can Oops. Uh oh. Might be the end of this guy. Oh boy. We'll leave things in suspense for a moment. 
Fast hyperdrives, okay. Fast hyperdrives. Fast times at hyperdrives. Next we have advanced logistics, okay. Oh, we have three people not working. I already forgot what that one was, man. logistics here it is what were you discovered or something let's try Cody instead then Ninety percent, way better. Is Mac my trader? Yeah, double agent. Okay, so he's just kind of garbage. Well, let's see if there's any low-hanging fruit that we can get from him. Annihilating bombardment. That sounds pretty ferocious. Oh no. Oh no. This guy definitely has a hard time. Okay, advanced bombardment is only 90%. I don't think I want, I definitely don't need that, but whatever. Oh, it's, it's taking so long for him to die. Well, we're getting good mileage out of our researchers if they only die once every century or so. Well, okay, wow, Koopy has stolen another one. Hyper jump inhibiting. That could be useful to put on our medium space ports, but I'm not sure. Space stations, I should say. Research information. What do we want? What do we want? What do we want? Capital ships? Oh my gosh. Combined military command? What? I'm not even sure exactly what that was, so I'm not even sure. I don't know why, but I, I'm just kind of hoping it's... Combined military command. Galactic command center. So I'm pretty sure that you can upgrade your... Would it be your military one? Yeah, I guess so. Military one should, um, sorry, the military academy should upgrade to the Galactic Command Center. Colony income and mining rate at the planet itself does diminish, so, you know, you're going to take a hit on other things in order to make that planet, like the military home base, kind of. No, I don't, I don't want your protection. I don't know, I'm not sure how to approach the situation with our... They are our allies, but it's hard for me to... <laughs> not want to invade them, basically. I guess the other thing is... Oh, mission failed. Gordos failed to steal large civilian ships. Okay, we'll, we'll just run that one back. Oh no. Oh no. Oh yeah. Maybe we'll send him somewhere else just for a little bit. 
I mean, I don't know what ultra-dense projectiles are. They're probably... Um, I mean, one would imagine they're uh, railgun related, but... It's 90%. It's not Buscarn Consciousness, so both are wins in my book. So, time-wise, we've made some good progress. We haven't stayed paused for too long. Or, you know, I guess it's relative to say that, but... I've been trying to keep our time moving along. A 28-22, so we've been, what, playing for like 70 years so far? Well, I'll probably just bring this one to a close pretty quickly here. It's super late for me. I gotta keep working, so... Yeah, let's go ahead and wrap it up. Um, yeah, dude, this is... We're hitting kind of a, a stalemate here. I feel bad about that. It's like, I'm not really sure what the best way forward is. Because I don't like to take over my neighbors. And the ones I would like to take over, I'm very, very good friends with. And we're working... I don't know, I'm just going to have to either commit to being, you know, for takeover being mean and all that. Or I, I guess I should just commit to expanding somewhere else. One of the two should happen now. Okay, well, for now, thanks for watching. And until the next one, take care.